check it out, Casper! Hey everyone, and thanks for tuning in. Casper here, and I tried to make the title as clear as possible, but let me just explain. Today we're going to be talking about how you can get some free hats in Team Fortress 2, which you need to play other free-to-play games to get. So, in order to get these hats in Team Fortress 2, you have to do an achievement in a different game on Steam. All these games are completely free. All the things you have to do in order to get the achievement, you can be done without spending a penny. So they're free hats in that sense. And um, to be perfectly honest, most of them are quite easy to get. You don't have to play these games for long. So the first one is the Spiral Select or Soleil. I don't know how you're really meant to say it. It's from the game Spiral Knights. And you can see it here, modeled by my wonderful assistants. It's an all-class hat. I think it looks pretty cool. In order to do it, you've got to play the game Spiral Knights and reach the Clockworks Terminal. So what that basically means it's essentially play through the tutorial. It's not going to take you very long. All of these, in fact, are probably going to take you less than an hour to do. And this game is sort of, I don't really know how to describe it. I've described it as sort of like a child-friendly dungeon crawler. You just sort of move slowly through a dungeon with a couple of teammates. Um, they don't have to be like people you know. It's just an open world thing where people just randomly go in together. And then you call some dungeons. Pretty simple and you get this nice hat at the end of it. So next one is another all-class hat. And it looks like an American football helmet with sort of spikes down it. Again, I think this is a pretty cool hat and it looks really good on some classes. The pyro sort of wears it a bit derpy to sort of suit him. This game you've got to play is Crime Craft Gang Wars and you've got to get the achievement key to the city. And what that actually means is to reach level 6. Now, unfortunately, I'm not 100% sure whether you're going to be able to achieve this against bots because the online community of this game isn't very big. So if you were trying to grind out this hat and get to level 6, it might take you some time. The next two are both from the same game. They are the Triclops, which is a pyro hat. It's got two styles, so you're looking at them both now. And the other one is the Flamingo Kid for the Sniper. Both of these pretty nice hats. The Triclops is a bit weird and you can put all sorts of cosmetics on with it that clip like hell, but um, on its own, I think it's a pretty cool hat. To get both of these, you actually have to do slightly different things. For the Flamingo Kid is Agent Level 5, and the Triclops is Agent Level 20. Now basically what that means is just play the game, keep playing the game, win some games. And this game's uh, Super Monday Night Combat, I don't think I said that yet. Uh, Super Monday Night Combat is sort of like what I would describe as a MOBA mixed with an FPS. It's a, it's a very like bright colours, sort of TF2 in that sense. And yeah, you just basically go down the lanes and take out the enemies where you can and capture their terminals sort of thing. It's actually a reasonably fun game, to be fair to it. Again, I'm not sure how big the um, online community is. This promotion for the Team Fortress 2 items did come out three years ago. Now, as we all know, games like Team Fortress 2 can live for a very long time. So I'm not telling you that the community is definitely dead and this won't be possible, but that is how you get it. The next one is the Alien Swarm Parasite, another all-class hat. You might have seen this one before because this is actually quite an old promotion. So it's been in the game longer than the other ones that we've mentioned. And to do this is probably the easiest one. It doesn't depend on an online community. You can do this with a friend. You have to complete two co-op missions in the game Alien Swarm and as with all the games it's a free game to download on Steam. Final one I'm going to talk about isn't a hat it's actually a knife for the spy backstabbing knife and it is actually a really nice looking weapon. Here's some artwork for it and here's how it looks in game. To get it you have to complete an achievement in the game Alliance of Valiant Arms and all you have to do to get this one is create a character and play one game. Again the online community isn't huge on this but um, the comments on the uh, Steam community uh, i.e. the reviews for this game are all quite funny. Most of them are just people saying install game, get Team Fortress 2 knife, an install game. <laughs> Which, yeah, I mean, that's fair enough. That's all you've got to do. And you do get this pretty cool looking knife. Final one I want to mention, just because I don't think it's going to fit into any other video, and I want people to know about this, is the Professor Specs. Now, you don't have to play any other game to get these. The method is to have a friend who is free to play, who then upgrades to premium and at that point they will get asked did anyone help you did anyone refer you well, I'm not sure the exact wording of it but if they select your name from their friends list or whatever it might be you then will get awarded the professor specs and there'll also be a count then of how many people that you've helped they're quite cool they're actually um tinted glasses so they're almost like um sunglasses as opposed to normal spectacles so they can look pretty trendy on a few of your classes I hope you guys found out about some hats you didn't already know. There will be links in the description to the um, Wikipedia articles for all of these hats. So if I haven't described it very well or you haven't jotted down the name of the game, you can see all the links there and how to get them.
any questions guys let me know and if you're aware of any other hats that I missed somehow let me know and then hopefully some people reading the comments will learn about those hats and get those as well.